What calamity has to occur before you finally admit it's time to do something? Something else, not this, not a full-scale invasion of a nuclear power that has said they will not tolerate our crossing their border. Saul is watching the world inch closer to a nuclear exchange. Just give us a target, any target. Plausible coordinates, that's all I'm asking. You hear what I'm saying? He's convincing Tazdeem to give him false coordinates about where Jalal might be. We'll take the time to take out some abandoned farmhouse in the middle of nowhere, and that will buy me time to get to the bottom of where the flight recorder is. While Saul's at work on that, Carrie's at work on trying to figure out who the asset is. There were a number of avenues that she could pursue, and the first one would be just to go up to Saul and ask him outright. So there have been rumors for years yeah, rumors. that you have some sort of undeclared source. I don't. If there were ever a time. I don't. Did you hear me? The season is about resolving this Carrie Saul mentor protege relationship. That was our mission statement of the year. We're going to take these two characters on a journey that puts them in the most extreme possible situation. If you can't find the asset, you can still take Saul out of picture. She vowed to herself that she would never allow another 9-11 to happen in the very first episode that we ever shot. And here, there is the very real possibility of a nuclear exchange happening between Pakistan and the United States, with arguably hundreds of thousands of lives involved. You knew Saul would never give up his asset. Her entire morality, her entire being is caught up in this choice. What's she going to do? That's the question that we answer in the next episode.